Hunt Flint police searching for a man wanted in connection to a deadly stabbing that took place in October. Thanks for watching the news at six. I'm David Custer and I'm Meg McLeod. For the first time, the victim's sister is speaking out, telling TV 5's James Felton she won't give up until her brother's killer is behind bars. Chuck, you're out there and you have any piece of man in you, you would turn yourself in. That's Heidi Yost's message to Charles Crutcher. Flint police issued an arrest warrant for Crutcher for first degree murder. Yost tells us on October 19th, her brother Donald Kassler was stabbed to death. One of my worst nightmares ever was the knock at the door. Yost says Kastler was at home in his kitchen when the attack took place. She believes Kastler was able to walk out of his front door before making it across the street to ask for help. He died moments later. You know, he was a good guy. Everybody loved him. Yost tells us Kastler and Crutcher were in a relationship that turned abusive. He did have four episodes of being hospitalized and facial surgeries. In spite of that, Yost says her brother stayed with Crutcher. I don't think he knew what to do, as people don't. So, you know, people do need to get that help and always reach out there because you, know, you never think it will result in this. Yost has no clue where Crutcher is, but she knows somebody does. If anybody knows where he's at, please turn him in. Yost tells us that now, every time she turns on the news, she hopes Crutcher's picture will be on the screen with the announcement that he's in custody. It's something she thinks her brother would appreciate. I know it's not going to bring him back, and I think that's the part that's the hardest, but it will do him justice because he knows he's watching us, and I want to keep fighting for him. Reporting in Flint, James Felton, WNEM, TV5. Flint police tell us Crutcher is considered armed and dangerous. Crime Stoppers is offering a reward of up to $1,000 for information leading to his capture. Just call 1-800-422-JAIL. That's 1-800-422-JAIL. Military-grade explosives discovered in a salvaged car door, and police are now thanking the Flint resident who alerted them. Police say on Saturday, a resident was in the process of utilizing a door he had purchased at a salvage shop in KPEC located in St. Clair County. Authorities say the man was installing the door when he found the explosives. Authorities secured them and placed them at a secure location. Flint police